hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so for this look i'm going to be doing a really really cute joker and harley quinn set um i'm doing these on my little sister she envisioned this whole look and i just made the look come to life so the first thing that i'm going to do is just be painting the pinky with black gel polish and then i'm going to go ahead and start painting the middle finger and for the middle finger i'm using a white polish and it's regular polish and then for the thumb I'm going to be doing a silver base polish and that's regular polish as well. And for these you can use any black, white or silver polish that you want. this hand i'm going to be switching it up a bit and i'm going to be going in with a white polish on the pinky and then you'll see me paint a clear on the next three fingers and that's just because when i use se gel it requires a base coat so i just went ahead and coated all three of those and then on the middle i'm going to be using a red gel polish and then on the thumb again i'm going to be using a silver and the silver is regular polish also the base coat does have to be cured for 30 seconds i'm going through and doing a second coat of polish on both hands on the regular polish i did recoat the gel polish as well and i don't know why because on two of the nails with the gel polish i'm going to be doing full stone nails so i wasn't thinking about it at that time For this hand, it's going to be the joker side, and I'm going to be doing two vertical ombre nails with the gel polish, and I'm going to be doing black and green on this hand. As you guys see, I'm just putting the black on one side, putting the green on the other side, and then kind of blending them in the middle, and I'll just go through this step a couple times and cure in between just to get the desired look that I want. And I'm going to be, of course, cleaning around the edge with my little brush and some acetone. I don't want, but I 
And once I'm done, I am going to be carrying this under the LED slash UV light for 60 seconds. And then I'm going to be moving on to the other hand. So next on this hand is going to be the Harley Quinn side. And I'm going to do a red and black vertical ombre. And like I said before, I'm going to be doing the red and then the black or the black and then the red. And then I'm going to be blending them in the middle. To get the desired look and i am going to be carrying this hand in the led slash uv light for 60 seconds as well So next on the middle finger, I'm going to be going in with some black acrylic paint and I'm going to be using for this design a lining striping brush and a dotting tool and I'm just going to draw two lines down the middle and then three lines going across and this is just so I can create the checkered look and I like to use the dotting tool when I'm filling in big spaces just so that the polish or paint is distributedly even in the space that I'm trying to fill.
And I'm just going to, after I'm done with the design, take my cleaning brush and clean around the edge. And I'm just using acetone. And I'm gonna be doing the exact same thing on the pinky, making two lines down the middle and then three going across and then filling it in with my dotting tool. So next, I'm going to be doing something really, really dope on both fingers. I'm going to be doing a really detailed drawing. So on this thumb, I'm going to be doing like the Joker smile. So like the mouth and the nose. And then on the other thumb, I'm going to be doing half of Harley Quinn's face, the top half. And we are doing like the cartoon animated look um, and the old school Joker and Harley Quinn. So for this, I just like to do a gel top coat and I am doing a gel top coat over regular polish. So like I said before, you wanna make sure that that's dry completely. Then you wanna cure for 30 seconds and then you can start whatever look you want to. And I am just drawing right on top of the gel top coat. Also, you don't have to do a gel top coat when you're doing a detailed design. I like to use the gel top coat just because if I need to go in with some acetone and a small brush just to erase something or, you know, clean up something, then um, I can do so and it's super easy and you guys will see me do that a couple times.
and again on this side I will be doing the top half of Harley's face so you'll see like the mask the nose and then you'll see the hat
So for the other hand on the darker side, I will be doing a complete full bling nail on the pinky using black bling. And I'm just going to start by applying them down the middle. And then like I said, I go from side to side. I'm also going to be applying some bling around the bottom of the ring finger and I'm just doing um, black and green. On this finger, I'm going to be applying more bling and I'm just going down the middle and I'm alternating from black and green. For the Harley side in the on her middle finger, I'm just gonna be applying some red bling and I am doing another full bling nail. On the ring finger on this hand, I'm going to go down the middle and I'm just going to alternate from red and black. And then on the pointed finger, I'm going to go around the bottom and then I'm just going to be alternating from red to black. And I am using my Mia Secret Gel Resin, my wax pencil, and my glue drying spray. Next, I'm going to be applying my Valentino Pure Gel Non-Wipe Top Coat on all of the nails, making sure that the ones with regular polish and acrylic paint are completely dry before I do this step. And I am going to be carrying both hands under the LED slash UV light for 30 seconds.
Next, I'm going to be applying my cuticle oil as always, and then I will be done with this look. And I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Um, I really enjoyed doing this. It was super, super fun. And my little sister, she was trying to challenge me and see what I really could do because we're both drawers and we both like to do creative stuff. But if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Leave me comments below and let me know what you guys want to see. Also, if you have any questions.